Hey guys, I'm out here in the shed again. It's raining. It's been raining all day. We've had tornado warnings and had all the kids and everybody in the basement earlier. Um, worst of the weather's passed, but it's still raining. Uh, and I found this. I've got a leak, which is good to know. It means I got to get up there somewhere and find out where it's coming in at. I saw a drip. I imagine it's coming around that off-colored part of the uh, ceiling there is actually a skylight. I would guess it's probably leaking from around there somewhere. But it's part of the process. One of these days, if I keep this channel alive long enough, you guys will see this shed transformed into a beautiful kingdom right now it's I mean it's better than what I had I had a two-car garage before full of stuff um, it's grown obviously I've moved here and it's a lot bigger than what I had but I'll get there but anyway what I want to do right now is go through some of my brother's old cards I've gotten a few new subscribers um, which is awesome. I'm pretty new at this. And so every new subscriber helps. This is, and I'm still not 100% convinced this isn't my set of cards, but what's mine is my brother's. And it's his, so he says it's his. So I'm going to go with it. But I'm going to flip through, see what we got. I have an idea of what we got. It's kind of a hodgepodge. It's mostly basketball. Um, lots of Jordan, Kobe Bryant rookies. We collected a lot. I mean, me and my brother and my cousin Seth would go every day almost. We'd scrounge up change and go buy packs of cards back in the late 90s, early 2000s. Probably not even early 2000s. About, about the era when Kobe Bryant was a rookie. Um, Stefan Marbury, Allen Iverson. Uh, so we got a lot of cards from that genre, not genre, era of cards. But got some cool stuff. Some of them used to be worth a little bit of money, but nowadays it's hard to own. I doubt it. Well, let's get into it and see what we got. So, first page. And I'm not going to pull all of them out because it'll take forever. I'll just kind of look at some of the cooler ones. We've got a Yao Ming, Hakeem Olajuwon. Dual game materials, relics. Authentic. I don't know if they're game worn. It's not. I don't know if it's numbered either. Here's a cool one LeBron and Jordan. That's a beautiful card. Two of the greatest of all time. Maybe the two greatest of all time. Another Jordan. Memorabilia. Hall of Fame 2009. Let me spin it around so you can see a little better. Oh. Sorry. Another dual game materials. Emeka Okafor. Sean May, so not quite as high end as the Jordan and the LeBron James, obviously. And then you got a random Brian Brom Packers jersey. So, like I said, it's going to be kind of random. I don't know if he's interested. Like I said, this is my brother's set, so I don't know if he's interested in selling any of these. LeBron James, Jordan. Hakeem Warwick. Hey, look at the backs of these, see if there's any of them numbered. So, looks like they're just inserts, not necessarily short prints. Of course, they're 2009 2010 cards. Let's find that Jordan's. Here we go. Dual game materials. 
You have received a trading card of Michael Jordan and LeBron James game used basketball memorabilia. The memorabilia has been certified to us as having been used in an official NBA game. We hope you enjoy this piece of basketball history as we continue to keep you as close as you can get. So that's pretty awesome. Um, I said basketball used to be my sport. That's all we collected there for a while. And you'll be able to tell that with this set. And here are a bunch of Jordans. I'm not sure if he has this entire set. I don't know how many cards are in this set. But we're going to hang on to this, I think. So, I mean, the whole set's called Michael Jordan Legacy. 2008 2009 Michael Jordan Legacy. It goes pretty high. That's card number 285. I'm not sure if there's any value here, but it's cool cards anyway. And then down here in the corner, you got a Kobe Bryant now appearing. It's not his rookie card. Sorry if that rains very loud, because it is. I'm just going to kind of flip through and show some of what we got in here. Random baseball A-Rod. It's a flare card. Kobe Bryant, Dwayne Wade, who is that, Rick Smith, gold medallion, edit, hmm. he's got some random cards in here obviously, stuffed in this binder. Michael Jordan, Epsi, Kobe Bryant, Tops, Jason Kidd, and Gary Payton. There's another Kobe. I used to love these cards. I know they're kind of cheesy, but I think I was kind of a maybe like basketball's junk wax era. Not 100% on that, but Kevin Garnett was always one of my favorite players. Jermaine O'Neal had a good, promising career. Um, obviously didn't get to the level that Kobe Bryant then did, but still pretty cool. And then not, there's Kobe Bryant. Kobe. Kobe. And then there's a now showing Jason Williams. And he was my favorite player. Every night I'd get on, I think it was TBS or TNT, when I was a sophomore, junior, freshman in high school, senior too, to an extent. Um, most of my junior year, I remember getting on and watching basketball, and I'd always look forward to watching the uh, Kings play. I think his nickname was White Chocolate. He was an excellent ball handler. And obviously everybody enjoyed watching his ball handling skills. Here's an Eddie House autograph. LeBron James. And then there's a random hockey. I cannot tell who that is. I have no idea. Hold on. Roman. Let me look at the back of it real quick. Roman Hamerlick. MVP. Not sure why it's in here. Might have been worth some money at one point. This, my brother put this together probably 10 years ago. And so most of these cards were in here from that, that time. And they were probably worth more then. Marvin Williams. No idea. Derek Jeter memorable moments. That was one of my favorite sets back in the day. 96, 97 Fleer Ultra. So actually, it's earlier than I even remembered it being. 
I guess I was about, I graduated in 2002, I would have been probably freshman, sophomore at that time. Yeah, that's when, that was when we collected the heaviest, was right around that FLIR Ultra era. Reggie Williams. I always enjoyed him. Another Kobe Bryant. Carmelo, or Carmelo Anthony and LeBron James. And there's a Sergei Fedorov. Again, just some very random cards. Eddie House. I guess there was a time when Eddie House was like one of the top players. Um, obviously, he had some kind of skill because he's in this binder and my brother didn't keep crap in here. I don't think he ever kind of lived up to what he was expected to be, but here's another Kobe Bryant. Looks like a die cut. No, it ain't die cut. It's just a some kind of an insert card or something. Danny House is a die cut. Amari Stoudemire. Kobe Bryant, Hardwood Prospects. I had that card. Marvin Williams. He must have been another one of them. Flare Ultra Metal. Our Fleer Metal, I love those cards. That was a pretty good card back in the day. That was worth about, I don't remember, 30 or 40 bucks, I think. Insert, fresh foundation. And then here's some baseball. A-Rod, back to basketball. Kobe Bryant, All Sport PPF. The Mall Sport cards are kind of cool. There's a Skybox. Love those Skybox cards. They're some of our favorite packs to get. Here's a football. Emmett Smith, Daniel Ewing, rookie debut, Kobe Bryant, um, St. Louis Billikens. So probably, I can't even tell who that is. Hold on a second. <laughs> no idea. Somebody jackpot. Cool card. I'm a Billikens fan. Live close to St. Louis. I like the way that looks. Marcus Camby. Some of these guys had really promising rookie careers. Kind of fizzled out. You know. Injuries, whatever. Martel Webster. Probably another one. And then there's Albert Pujols. My brother and I are both hardcore Cardinals fans. Hardcore Blues fans who just, the St. Louis Blues just went to the Stanley Cup tonight for the first time in 49 years, I believe it is. Let's go, Blues. Chris Paul, rookie debut. And then there's Christine Brinkley. So, I don't, <laughs> no idea. I mean, that's super random. Andrew Bogut, another Jordan. I had a lot of those in my collection. I also had a lot of these. A lot of these cards I already had myself too. So we bought lots and lots of packs of cards. I'm just gonna start kind of scanning through. I'm talking way too much. If anybody sees anything that watches this, I've got a couple of new subscribers here lately. Um, if you see anything that's rare or random or valuable, let me know. Allen Iverson, one of my favorite players when I was younger. Stefan Marbury, also one of my favorite. Grant Hill, another one of my favorites. I had a lot of favorites. Jake Reed, it's a rookie, I think. No idea why it's in here. Other than it's blue, just a blue uh, parallel looks like. Do not know who that is. Oh, Kevin Garnett, duh. Sharif Abdul Rahim, he was my favorite player almost. Grizzlies, I always rooted for the players that had like a, a little bit of underdogs, I guess. I liked the Grizzlies, I liked him. The Kobe Bryant, rookie. I think that's a rookie. Another Kobe Bryant. 
Anthony Hardaway. And then Amani Toomer. Troy Aikman. Channing Fry. Stephen Curry. Just had a mouse run past me. Another rookie. Stephen Curry rookie's pretty decent. Kobe Bryant. Stephon Marbury. His career was cut short by injuries, I believe. Ricky Rubio rookie. Another Stephon Marbury rookie. Robert Trailer. Retro little mini card. Stephon Marbury retro mini card. Press pass 98. Maurice Spites. Masterpieces. Kobe. Jeff Pendergraf. A Rod. Josh Hamilton. Frank Robinson. Then and now. Josh Hamilton had such a promising career. Dirk Nowitzki. Eddie Jones. Michael Jordan Profiles. Garrigan Ruth. Sorry about that yawn. Collector's Choice tip-offs. Is that Chris Williams? Or Chris Weber, I mean. Yeah. Batting leaders, Josh Hamilton, Miguel Cabrera, Joe Maurer, and Adrian, Adrian Beltre. So you can definitely tell the era of cards there. 2010, Josh Hamilton was relevant. So he had such a promising career, but unfortunately things happen. Chris Weber, All Sport. That's, that cla that's classic, yeah. Mashburn, Hardaway, Mills, Ryder, and Weber. He was one of my favorite players, too. He actually played on the Kings there for a while with uh, Jason Williams. It was Jason Williams, Chris Weber, and Vladi Divas. I love watching them guys play. Shaquille O'Neal Ovation. Diamond Duos. Harmon Killebrew and Jim Tomey. Jamal Mashburn. Larry Bird. Michael Jordan. Shaquille. And Stan Musial. Not a real autograph, but still a cool card. Channing Fry. Kevin Durant. And then there's Shannon Elizabeth. Again. <laughs> it's a Shannon Elizabeth rookie card, too. Wow. It's hot. Greg Maddox and Jeremy Hellickson. Metalized Gary Payton. Then we're also some cool cards back in that flare metal. Another Stan Musial. Dwayne Wade. Gary Payton, Superman. I love that Skyback Z set. Johnson, Wainwright, and Halliday. Like I said, this is a pretty random set. Just lots of cool old cards. It's a nice Tom Seaver there. That's in good shape. That's got to be a re reprint. Oh yeah, it definitely is. <laughs> it's like, man, that's a... Well, obviously, if the Pee Wee Reese is beside it, and they were both in that good of shape, I'd probably have some money sitting in front of me. So cool cards. Steve Carlton, CeCe Sabathia, Carmelo Anthony. I'm not sure if that's his rookie or not. Kevin Garnett. Another Garnett, Chris Paul, Ezra Williams. A lot of these guys started out with really promising careers and kind of fizzled out due to injuries or whatever. There's Dante Pichette. I don't know if he's related to that Bo Bichette. Uh, new, not new, but well, kind of new rookie. It's out on the scene now. Imagine they are. Another Michael Jordan cut above. Chicago Bulls. Here's some more Jordan cards. Pff, 
Pratt Maynard. I don't know if that's a legit autograph or not. It looks like a reprint, but it's Pratt Maynard anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Probably not worth anything. Josh Judy. Travis Harrison. Looks like we're getting into some baseball here. Pedro, Beto, Sean May, Vince Carter. Another great player, career kind of cut short by injuries. Nathan Navaldi. Shaquille O'Neal, golden season. Blake Swihart. Let me look at the back of this Blake Swihart, see if it's legit autographed. Nah. I don't think it's a legit auto. It doesn't say congratulations or anything. I could be wrong. I'm just going to kind of scan through. I think we're getting more... Not necessarily base cards, but not anything fantastic. Here's a Stefan Marbury. I don't know if that's his rookie. I think it might be. Excuse me for a second. Um, I can't tell. I think it's... Yeah. Official Skybox rookie. I think that's what that says. It's kind of hard to read. Yeah. Official Skybox rookies, 96-97. So that's a Stefan Marbury rookie. Sorry about that. Paul Pierce, double threat. Matt Barnes. Here's a Albuquerque. Oh, Al Albuquerque. Bowman Chrome rookie card. That's Pendleton rookie card. Little Shaq. Joe Smith and Allen Iverson. Here's Iverson. Grant Hill. Eduardo Sanchez. And there's Allen Iverson rookie card, 96-97 Fleer. Allen Iverson Z-Box, or Skybox. Skybox Z-Force. Larry Green. Another Iverson. Tyler Chatwood rookie card. Bowman. That's Dan Patrick, I know it says, but yeah, it's Iverson. He just looks so young there. <laughs> he is young. Iverson. Chris Sale, rookie card. That's cool. Bowman Chrome. Chris Carpenter. Not my Chris Carpenter that I'm a fan of. That's the Cubs' Chris Carpenter. I'm a fan of the Cardinals, Chris Carpenter. Another Iverson. Mike Trout rookie card. That's a nice card. Chipper Jones. It's not his rookie, but it's the Gold Cup. Topps lineage. Mel Ott. So, I think I've went, I don't know, a third of the way through this set. I'll do one more page. And then I'll have to make another video because I'm at 24 minutes already and I don't want to keep these too long. Nolan Ryan, Stan Musial, these are all tops lineage. Kyle Ripken Jr., still cool cards. Stefan Marbury, rookie card. So random. Another rookie card, Stefan Marbury. Then a Kyle Ripken Jr. It's got to be, oh, that's next page over. Corey Lubke. Wesley Person, Darren Hancock, and Stefan Marbury. Bryce Harper, Chrome. I don't know if that's his rookie or not. Eh, uh, let say. Let me do this page since it's got that Kyle Ripken. Then we got to be reprints though. Juan Gonzalez, Ken Kim, and Eddie, both steroid era. Missing a couple cards out of the sleeve too. Mel Lott. 
Jaime Garcia, Reggie Jackson, Kyle Ripken, Julius Irving Masterpieces, and Derek Jeter Die Cup. Yeah, those are both reprints, but anyway. Thanks for watching. Um, I'll mark this. So I've still got quite a bit left to go. Um, I'll kind of mark it where I'm at, and then I'll continue this video next time. But lots of random cool stuff anyway. Hopefully this kind of brings back some memories. Takes you at least down memory lane or whatever. Um, but if anybody knows anything that's worth some money that I missed or might be interested in buying or whatever, drop me a comment, subscribe, like, all that good stuff. Um, thanks for watching. Appreciate it.